All right, here it is, the long-awaited video of the new place. Um, here's the view from our porch. This is the, what they're called, Mornal Diable over there. The Cabrits, the bay, and the sun's just now starting to set, so it's kind of pretty. We used to be down here, downstairs, but now we're up here, and that big tree right there is not in our way anymore. Um, so anyway, that door there is ours, and that door there is ours. Over here is our neighbor's uh, banana field, which, because they're nice people, they let us have free run of, so if we want to go pick some bananas and coconuts out of that tree there, they let us. And here's the kitchen. Way better than our last one, because it's not tiny. A little moving around space. Trina had this massive war today with all the ants in here, because there's apparently a giant ant hill underneath our cabinets. And, uh, yeah, so she kept spraying cleaner, and they kept trying to move their eggs to other parts of our house, and it was, it was pretty fun to watch. And my most prized possession, oh, my French press. Hey, you see my reflection, that's funny. Um, yeah. So, I think that's all that's interesting in here. Moving on. My shoes on the floor, as usual. This is bathroom number one. And right here is a bathroom number two. It's kind of a dumb arrangement that they're right next to each other like that. But this whole place is built to where like two people can, you know, split the place and, you know, the bedrooms lock and stuff. So, you don't even have to like your roommate to live here with someone. So, there's the end of our hallway. Two bathrooms on the right. In here is our bedroom. Turn on the light. And our fan, our other most prized possession, because it gets hot in here. Um, and that door goes to our back porch. I'll show you that in a second. And in here is my study room. Slash, it's going to become a guest bedroom. We're going to put up a like a curtain there so that we can have this when you have like more than one person visiting we can put the bed up in here um, we're moving that TV into the living room soon because it's a bit of a distraction and my desk and my whiteboard which is awesome to have I love that this place has a giant whiteboard looks like we got some uh, cranial nerve action going on there it's, it's good times anyway and here's that second door I showed you from out front In here was a bedroom, but we kind of made it into our computer storage dining room. And we're going to put the TV in that corner over there when we get some time. Um, yeah, when people come visit, we'll boot the uh, table out and be able to sleep someone in here too. This is our electricity meter. Looks like we got plenty of juice still. It's kind of weird. I don't know if I talked about it in my last video, but you have to buy electricity, like uh, groceries, and you just you know, punch in your number dee, 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 that they give you, and it puts it on here, and it counts down. If you look at this thing, I'm not really using very much electricity. Oh, there, it just flashed. It's a thousand flashes per kilowatt hour, so the faster it flashes, you can kind of tell how much electricity you're using. So I clock like every appliance in our house to see what uses what. And yeah. Yep, there it goes again, because I got all the lights on, because I'm making a video. But, yeah, once that number gets to zero, you no longer have any electricity and your power turns off. This is our back porch. It's continuous with everyone else's back porch, but it's pretty sweet because um, the only way to get through it is through one of the apartments. So I can put all my stuff out here and not worry about it getting ripped off. Like my barbecue, we cook a lot of stuff on that. That thing is awesome to have. And... Pretty good vertical gain. I don't know if you can really tell how high that gets behind us because it's it's way back in the distance. But we've got probably a 800 or a thousand foot gain going up to that first hill. We've never been we've never been up that thing. That's almost like a cliff face with stuff growing on it. And back off in that direction is Mount Au Diable, which is the highest mountain in Dominica. But because of this little mountain in front of us, we can't see it right now. And up there is our landlord's house you can see and that's the new place anyway 
Yeah, I can't think of anything else to really tell you about the joint. And more videos to come later.